Lord Fryron, please wake up. Only five minutes left. It's already been 10 minutes since you said that. I'm gonna wash my face now, okay? Me? Fern strammered in surprise. Why did I oversleep all the way to Fryron? Wondered another. The thing is, I have no memory of it. I know that feeling. I've definitely done that before, exclaimed one person. This is unbelievable. I, of all people, overslept, lamented someone else. Absolutely a case of hitting snooze. Chimmed in another. Hey, Lavin and Kane are coming over to talk us. Wait a minute. Don't interrupt them. What are you talking about? They're going on a date, you know. What? Are those two in that kind of relationship? As far as I can see, they don't seem to have that kind of vibe. I'm pretty sure they were smooching right nest to sleeping Lord Fryerin. He didn't wake up at all. Ken, you know a way. You've got a pretty cute face, don't you? Levine, is this one? Doing that right next to me while I'm sleeping. Seriously? I'll teach you a magic spell to block out the noise for both of you. Even I have to be careful not to wake him up with my loud voice. Was Asumin Ken snoring too loud? Hey, wait. It's Levine bringing him out here? What's that? I don't know anything about it. This is the magic of liking Fryren. 